big blaze raced through a warehouse in Pompano Beach today. The fire burned for hours and destroyed a furniture warehouse. CBS 4's Joe Murray is live on the scene for us right now with more in a very difficult firefight, right, Joan? It really was, Elliot. Good afternoon, and it is nothing but a shell of a building right now. Take a look. This is in the 800 block of Andrews Avenue in Pompano Beach. It's over five hours since this building went up in flames, and as you see, firefighters continue to douse hot spots. It was a very stubborn inferno. It was crackling, and it was like a pop. A worker shot cell phone video as the furniture warehouse exploded in flames. It was pretty wild, man. So, you know, scary at the same time, too, because it could spread. From Chopper 4 overhead, you could see the inferno as sofas, tables, and chairs went up in flames, adding fuel to the fire. This 50 gallon propane tank exploded and took flight. That actually shot out of the building across Andrews Avenue and almost struck our firefighters. They actually had to duck to take cover from being struck. The smoke so intense, firefighters had to close down Andrews Avenue. All the workers escaped, but firefighters could not contain the blaze. At that point, firefighters could not get inside the building. So what they did was they did a the defensive attack um, and kept the fire contained so it didn't. Um, spread to other buildings. No custom, you know. Everybody okay. called crazy, you know. Surrounding businesses stayed open, but no customers could drive in. It was very scary. I've never seen something like that. At Broughton Garage Doors, just a few doors down from the burning building, workers felt the effects of the fire in every way. We were so close. We were fleeing the heat from the fire all the way over here, and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is scary. We have to tell people on the phones that they can't come in because, you know, it's closed. Roads are closed, so it has a little bit of effect. We're told the warehouse just took delivery of two big rigs of furniture, now ashes. Within like 30 minutes, 30, 40 minutes, it was done. All done. We're told the building was actually in the process of being sold from one owner to another fire marshal, local fire marshal here. Uh, they are waiting on the state fire marshal, but we are told this road is going to be closed for several more hours, probably at least until 9 o'clock as firefighters continue to douse hot spots here. Uh, no one hurt. Three firefighters did have to be treated for heat exhaustion. Reporting live in Pompano Beach tonight, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News. Joan, thank you.